All right, enough about jobs and exams. Let's bring some music to you this morning and that is going to be done by our next guest on TVC. He is the man of the hour. He's just won his first Grammy and he's back in India. Good morning, Shankar. Thanks so much for joining us on TVC. You've kissed the Grammy. You've come back to a very heartwarming welcome as well. And all of this is making India proud at such a massive global platform. Tell us, what's the feeling like? How is it being back home with that Grammy? Oh God, I've just landed here. Yeah. I've just landed about a few, few, a few hours back and then not slept. Uh, so I think uh, it will take some time to sink in because we do not understand the, the magnitude of this particular... Uh, uh, awards, uh, you know, as far as, you know, the arts goes, uh, music, you know, hmm. uh, we are used to a certain kind of, uh, uh, you know, size. When you go there, you realize the whole world is looking at you. That's, you know, and that takes time to sink in. Uh, but it was an amazing experience. And I was very happy that uh, this band won the award for best global album because if there's any band in the world that has to win best global album, it has to be Shakti. It has to be Shakti. And I, you know, I think the key takeaway for me at least was that everyone now is Googling Shakti. Because it's not like a Bollywood kind of uh, structure. Now people want to understand what this band does, what is its track this moment. And how an Indian artist has created this such a beautiful thing or a, or a sort of galaxy of Indian artists have created such a beautiful thing. This non-Bollywood version getting in will really sort of have everybody talk about it. Yes, yeah, Sonal, that is what I am very happy about. See, there is a, there's an underlying depth to this, this whole winning of this award. Because see, winning the award and coming back home is a different thing. But now... This is almost like uh, uh, educating the people of the world about the deep music that uh, our country has got. It is not only about Bollywood, you know. You should understand that uh, our classical music is very, very, very deep. It's very intense. Uh, you know, the aesthetics are, I mean, it's thousands of years old. Uh, there is so much so much to learn we are still learning and and you know if you don't it's like uh, opening a treasure chest to the world and saying hey look at this this is my treasure from my country you know mm, and yeah. that is what they get amazed uh, mm. you know i met some amazing musicians who are like they've got only about 17 grammys 18 grammys <laughs> and all that but they are just stunned mm. listening to our music they said how the hell do you all do this mm. because of the sheer deep foundation of of uh, music that we have, Karnataka or Hindustani music from our country, we are able to like, our music is like water, it finds its place anywhere, you know, so that's yeah. the beauty. Yeah, and you know, for me, it's also a true representation of India that a Raja Gopal, a Hussain, a Mahadevan and a Chaurasya got together to make a beautiful sort of uh, band called Shakti. And I think what's even more beautiful is the story of India that it represents to the world. How is it sort of jamming with all these artists? Yeah, Shakti is a 50-year-old band, by the way. Shakti hmm. is a 50-year-old band. We just completed our 50th anniversary tour. Not that I've been with the band for 50 years. The thing is, this band was founded 50 years back by John McLaughlin and Ustad Zakir Hussain. And there were some legendary musicians. Uh, the person who was playing the percussion, <coughs> sorry, Selva Ganesh, his father, Vikku Venagram, was part of the group. And they are they are the people who set the tone for what is fusion music. Because classical musicians used to only perform classical. You know, a guitarist would only play his genre of music. What happens when these two get together, you know? I mean, for, technically, I'll just be, I'll uh, explain in a minute. Indian music does not have the concept of harmony. You know, hmm. it's something. It's like changing the background of a painting. You 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 paint a tree, but then if you have a plain background, that looks different. If you, if you have a different background, hmm. the tree looks completely different. So that is harmony. So the concept of harmonizing Indian music was done by Shakti 
50 years back and wow. then of course there were so mm. many people who you know got into fusion and all that so after mm. 25 years i have joined the band and i've been with them for 25 years and here we are with the grand yeah talking about backdrop i'm loving that pichwai in your backdrop as well very very nice and colorful over there but i want to take you back shankar to the winning moment and uh, how you dedicated the award with a special mention to your wife and i'll quote what you said then you said that i would like to dedicate this award to my wife whom every note of my music is really for it's really lovely listening to it during valentines week of course but what's going on at home what are the celebrations like the uh, it is i mean i would go further in saying that it's not only that every note of music i dedicate to her i think just my existence here yeah, it is it is dedicated to her because my life is her life her life is my life and it's been a beautiful life we are married for 31 years now and i know her for 10 years before that so all in all i know her for 41 years okay so there's not been a single moment in our life where there is no longing for each other so thoda intense kahani hai so jaane do so uh, a little part of that i i did it uh, at the at the grammy so i just wanted to dedicate every note of my music to her because uh, and and unfortunately she could not come for this momentous occasion because mm. she fractured her Ooh. foot two days before her uh, you know uh, before our flight and oh. she had dressed her you know the, the all the top designer labels they had made dresses mm. for her it was mm. all like tried out altered and fully excited can you imagine sonal mm. and just before leaving she had, so it was a it, mm. it, unfortunate but in my bedroom there was a party happening mm-hmm. there were about mm. 30 people in my bedroom watching the television and as if they are there the and it was total mayhem mm-hmm. once once it was declared that we won the award so right, that is the story lovely lovely but usko jaane nahi dete intense love story ki baat bhi karenge kisi din but maybe some other time i also uh, you know everybody who comes on tbc we ask them about their morning routine uh, so i want to understand from you how does uh, shankar mahadevan really wake up does he wake up in the morning to riyaz and meditation or mornings are like to some really head banging jam what are mornings in shankar mahadevan's house like So, firstly, I am not a grumpy morning person. Okay, lovely. I am a very active morning person. I get up and I'll be as active as I. Everybody wonders how the hell does he do it? I mean, he just wakes up and he's as fresh as ever. That is that something that is God given, I think so. So, I love my mornings. I love my mornings. In fact, however late I am in the night, I want to. I want to be awake for the those beautiful hours. I don't. I I feel that I'm wasting my time sleeping. when i come and look at i go to my terrace upstairs and you know the birds are chirping i just love that one two hours just there and then probably i'll come back and sleep again yeah. i don't care but those morning hours is yeah. they are very important to me hmm. my morning cup of coffee hmm. and just you know just thinking just not even listening to music you don't even need to listen to music you just need to like kind of reset your brain and just be in that moment this moment that is the name of the album by the way yeah yeah lovely uh, indeed and uh, thanks so much shankar for joining us and sharing your story with us but i really want to say there are very few people like you who have aced bollywood who have aced sort of classical music as well and at a moment like this when you have got the grammy it's the ultimate award one can really get right what song really comes to mind can you sort of uh, take us through that well uh, since since the the album is called this moment and we have done a very important song with my two brothers ehsan and loy you've done a very important song which also defines this moment you know and this i am realizing this moment when i'm talking to you, i'm not joking this is a song about this moment which is my bollywood life and my non bollywood life and the song goes like this khar ghadi badal rahi hai roop zindagi chhao hai kabhi kabhi hai dhoop zindagi har pal yahan this moment ji bhar ji ho 
जो है समा कल हो ना हो man shankar you've made our day you've made our morning and clearly it's been your year thanks so much for joining us and loved having you on tbc and good good luck for everything that you're doing lovely sonal your energy is amazing trust me thank you very much have a superb day Thanks thanks so much. So this was lovely right what more can you really ask for lovely to know that Shankar is also not a grumpy morning person and gets up as active as the entire team of TBC